Hello everybody, just want to do a quick video for you, um, just about some things that I think are important in your business as you're getting started and um, becoming successful and just kind of get that ball rolling. And um, three huge things are the three vital behaviors. This will be huge for your business um, with motivation, with consistency, um, with being professional as well. Um, the three vital behaviors are key. Number one, invite, invite, invite. Now, um, I'm not gonna lie, inviting is, was not easy for me. I um, had a really hard time the first couple times that I did it. It was like, I'd, I'd go to type it, I'd delete it, wouldn't send it. Or I'd, you know, I'd sit down and I'd scroll through all my friends on Facebook and I'd be like, oh, who do I talk to? I don't know, not them, not them. And it, you know, I just, I would put it off, put it off, put it off. And for the first couple months, I didn't really need to invite. Um, luckily, I had a significant enough, you know, story and weight loss that people responded to it and came to me and I didn't have to um, seek them out. I was able to be successful enough with people coming to me that I really didn't invite for the first couple months. And then after a while, your, you know, your, your group of people that were interested are starting to kind of they've either bought the program or they're, you know, doing the program or they've decided not to do the program and they've moved on for whatever reason. And, um, you know, your pool gets a little smaller. And so you realize that, yes, I actually do need to be inviting. And so my advice is to just do it. Sometimes you just have to write the invite, turn away and hit click hit send and just walk away from the computer <laughs> because you don't want to be, sitting there worrying about what they're thinking, what their response is going to be. Um, you've done nothing but offer them a, of something of value. You've given them a chance to change their life if they want to. You're not trying to sell them a product. You're trying to, you're selling yourself. You're selling your experience. You're selling your um, advice and your support and your help and to get them through their journey. And there's nothing in the world wrong with offering that to somebody. And you never know who's going to need it. I actually had a, a girl that I used to live in town and had moved away and we'd stayed in touch you know, a little bit on Facebook, nothing big. And um, I sent her a message just kind of catching up with her, telling her that, um, you know, I love seeing pictures of her girls and that I missed having her in town. And would she be interested in joining one of my health and fitness groups? And she actually messaged me back and said that she had been praying about contacting me and um, was really thinking about making a change in her life. And I'm not sure that if I hadn't reached out to her that, you know, she might have eventually contacted me, but I don't know when that would have been or if she would have gotten the nerve to do it. So, I mean, you just never know what somebody else is waiting, you know, on the other end of that computer, what they need. And what's the worst that can happen? They say, no, thank you. Or they ignore you and that's okay I mean people have ignored me and that's you know next time I see them I'm not gonna treat them any different I'm just gonna hey how are you you know going about life it's wasn't for them not a big deal and if they say no thank you then you say okay great if you change your mind I'm here you know don't harass people don't bug people but just let them know that you know you're open to them and make it easy just make it make it helpful um, number two be proof the products work so you want to Drink your Shakeology every day, post about it, talk about it, about how good it makes you feel. Um, and you're not going to have to make that up because that's the truth. It does make you feel amazing. It, you know, how it helps reduce your cravings and it helps you have energy, how it's your go-to meal on the go when you don't have time or it's your workout recovery. Um, well, however you use it, post about it and share it with people. Share recipes um, and just let them know the value of Shakeology. Um, if you are doing a program, share your progress, share your results, talk about it. <clears throat> if you want to post a, you know, a selfie while you're working out, that's great. Um, get more comfortable with that because I know that's not easy. The more you do it, the easier it becomes. Sometimes you, again, put the picture up there, click, send, post, walk away. You know, don't be scared to do it. If people don't like it, if people, um, are for whatever reason offended by your healthy lifestyle, that's their issue, not yours. <laughs> There's nothing to be embarrassed or ashamed about. You're happy, healthy, excited, and you just want to share how you feel with others. And that's to be admired. So don't be ashamed to share that. Um, 
and finishing a program is huge, I think, as well. I, of course, mine was 21 Day Fix, and I think I've gone through about 85 rounds of it now, and I pretty much it, it's kind of a lifestyle fix for me at this point. Um, and, but when Hammer and Chisel comes out, I'm going to do that program start to finish because I really feel like I've got the nutrition part under control. Um, but to, to, to have a dedicated workout plan like that is something that I've never really done before. I mean, I've always been a gym goer and I've always gone to classes and exercise and stuff like that, but I've never had a program that was designed like this one is designed and that I've done from start to finish. So I'm really excited about doing that. I can't wait to post about that, share those results with people. Before and afters are big. I know that's not easy either, but if you can do before and afters or share inches lost, you know, if you don't want to share pounds lost, share inches lost. Um, share pictures of your face. You know, because I know my face before I lost 20 pounds looked a lot different than it does now. So you don't have to show your body. You can just show your face and show the difference um, and to people. And that's that's big. The proof is in the pictures for sure. Um, also, number three, personal development is um, really big. And this one was actually pretty easy for me because I've always been a reader and I've always enjoyed that kind of stuff. Um, motivational videos and things like that. So that was pretty easy for me. But when I first became a coach, I, I got the compound effect and listened to it um, on audible. And I loved that book. It was amazing. Like every day I would listen to it. And I'd come home and I'd be like, write a note, write a note, you know, about something that I learned from that book. And it was just such a simple concept to me. So that was, that was, that's a really good one. Compound effect by Darren Hardy. Um, You're a badass by Jen. Cicero, I believe is her name. Also a really good one. Uh, a little bit funnier, um, just about finding your inner badass and not being afraid to share it with people and figuring out, you know, how to, how to get there. Um, you also want to, of course, listen to the weekly wake up call on Beachbody. That's big. You find out information um, about the latest products, the latest challenge pack promos, all that kind of stuff. And I really kind of enjoy here in the rank advancements at the beginning of the call because it kind of makes you go, hmm, one day I want my name to be announced in the rank advancements. I want there to be Briar Willis scrolling across that. So that's, I find that motivating personally. And then of course your team calls, um, you know, we have a weekly team call with Megan, one fit fam, and then um, her upline, Deidre Penrose, uh, Forever Fit, um, also has a weekly call. And then of course Melanie's dream team, who is our, consider her like your great, great grandma coach. Um, she does a dream team call every Monday night and those are always, uh, really of great value to listen to. So I've been trying to post the links on our page, our team page for you to listen to those if you have interest, but that's also another great person to search for, uh, personal development is Melanie Metro videos, Megan Blinka, Deidre Penrose, all those, um, our upline coaches that have found great success, very good success in this business are, they're wonderful people to look to for advice and, um, motivation and encouragement. And also, and if you can't make your team call at night, they're always recorded and they're always posted. So you can watch them the next day because I know nine o'clock can be tricky for some of us who are old and can't stay up that late sometimes. So if you have to <laughs> go back and watch it the next day, that is okay. Not a problem. Um, quarterly events in your area. Um, the Super Saturday events are great for um, hearing those stories, the success stories, and the motivational stories, and meeting other coaches, and just connecting, and um, sharing ideas. It's just, it's really great to uh, get you excited about the business. Um, there's one in January up in, in Pittsburgh that I'm actually going to go to this year so I can meet Megan, my coach, who I can't believe I've never actually met in person. I feel like I've known her forever, but I'm going to go up there and there's going to be a big dream team event and a Super Saturday event and they'll have a celebrity trainer and Carl Deichler is actually going to be there for that one as well. So I'm going to go ahead and make the trek up to Pittsburgh and go for that one. But um, yeah, so those are some you know ideas on how to get those three vital behaviors done and how important they are. And just also share your story, share, share, share. Don't be afraid to post. Don't be afraid to talk about your, your ups, your downs, but always put a positive spin on it. Even when you're down, you know, say this bad thing happened to me, but I got through it or, you know, the cravings were bad today, but I drank my shake instead of, you know, eating a 
candy bar. So there's always a way to turn it around and get people motivated and get people excited and be relatable too, so that they understand, you know, your journey and where you're, where you've come from. So hope that helps and you guys have a fantastic day.